Hello again and welcome back to Dave the Diver. It's a stormy night, but we can't do any more diving because we already dove. We'll dive another night. First, let's head over to the farm and do some harvesting. Let's pick these guys up. We got yoink, uh, garlic, garlic, and garlic. Let's go buy some more garlic seeds so we can just plant them immediately keep this ball rolling here. And, um, is there anything growing here? Oh, I can just water it. Uh, okay. Garlic seed. Garlic seed. Garlic seed. I thought I plant... Okay, there we go. Now it's telling me some stuff. Okay. Okay, we've got some eggplants sprouting here. Okay. There we go. There we go. I don't have to go to my app for it to tell me about what's growing here. Should we open up uh, new uh, rows here? We got a little bit of gold. Let us see if we can expand it. Holy moly, we need 8,000 for another row? Otto, you're ripping me off, dude. Gee whiz. It's outrageous. Outrageous, I say. So... We got some rice growing here, and uh, I guess I just have to remember that rice just grows on its own. I don't have to plant rice. I don't understand rice. <laughs> I've never grown rice. Uh, growing up, my family had um, a little uh, garden on our property. So, I mean, I'm familiar with growing stuff like this, but rice is a mystery to me. Okay, let's go sell some sushi. Okay, no new people coming in. We can take a look at uh, research, see if there's any new menus here. Uh, we've got uh, Plotosid Pie. That is a fish that I don't believe I've ever seen. We have a lot of wheat, but... Uh, oh, striped catfish is what we're going to want for that. We're going to want to bring a net out to catch the catfish. Why is this called Plotosid Pie if it has catfish in it? A carefully prepared Plotosid pl Plotosid? I'm not familiar with that word. And minced onion are baked to make this rich pie. The dish looks like a fish staring into the night skies. Okay. Here we've got pelican eel jelly. Uh, we don't have any pelican eels at the moment. Smoked Atlantic mackerel scramble. We don't have any Atlantic mackerel. Colmer sandwich. Well, we do have some Colmer, but we don't have any painted Colmer. And, um, no Starry Puffer, no Big Eye Scat, although I'm sure I've seen that before. We may even have some of that in our farm. More Starry Puffer. Small started, Spotted Dart. We don't have any of that, really? Um, here's some more Shark. Goblin sharks, fatty meat. We don't even see grapes, but uh, we're growing some. Let's go ahead and research this. Okay, we researched that. Uh, okay, small started spotted dart. Um, Sally Lightfoot crab. Wow, it's telling us it's in the shipwreck interior. I mean, we could go ahead and learn it. Why not? Blobfish spring roll. We have a few blobfishes. That's in the glacier passage. I don't go in there very often, so it seems to me like it's going to be difficult to get more of that stuff. Maybe one of these days we'll have to take a net down there in the glacier passage and See if we can't get some row. This is all of oh, cherry tomatoes. I don't know if I've seen that. Can we grow those? I haven't seen that. There's some shrimp. We could uh, go ahead and research this. Why not? And then finally, the last thing down here is fried tomato and snail snailfish. We don't have any of that. Okay, that's pretty good. More research. Let's go ahead and put together our menu. 
So once again, the first thing we're gonna look at is taste. And we've got a taste up to 210. Good old vegetable sushi. Wish we had more ingredients because we cannot enhance this any further. Look, if we could enhance, enhance this two more times, we'd get over 250 and we'd finally be able to upgrade our cooksta, but we can't. So again, I'm not gonna put this on the menu today because I wanna hold on to this, get more carrots so that we can enhance this further. This is for the uh, VIP event coming up, so I don't wanna put that on the menu. Here's some Marlin sushi. Uh, let's go ahead and put it on the menu as is. This is also for the event coming up. We've got some Great Barracuda sushi. Great Barracuda, man, um, is a dish that um, we can make a lot. We see a lot of Great Barracuda. They're always on our tail. And um, we could always catch more. I feel like, easily. Okay, more stuff for Shark Knight. Uh, we get some more of this chambered Nautilus. I mean, we this these things grow like crazy in our fish farm. So we can easily enhance these. I don't think we'll ever get them up to 250 though. So I hope people like chambered Nautilus sushi because we have a butt ton of it. Okay, now I'm getting to a point where I don't have many ingredients. We could put blue tang on here. Could enhance, no, we cannot enhance that any further. So let's just go ahead and put blue tang on the menu because we have so much of it. And then we also have quite a bit of whatever this is, yellow tang. Well, you know, do blue and yellow theme, tang theme. What else do I have a lot of? I have a lot of Green Humphead Parrotfish Sushi. I don't think we're gonna make a lot of money tonight. This stuff, you know, I I normally sort by price before I put my menu together and I didn't do that this time. But I think we'd come up with about the same results anyway. Kind of looking like lots of dishes for this VIP night. Holy cow, or this event night, tons of it. Put this on the menu, Purple Sea Urchin. I mean, it doesn't sound very good to me, but I don't know. I'm not gonna try it. Okay, let's go ahead and open this up and uh, sell some sushi. Oh, we got this thing here now. I, I hope my people can serve this thing because I don't want to do it. Nobody's ordered anything yet? Perfect. Oh man, it's getting busy out here. People wanting their beers. There's a sound, a little boop boop sound that I'm not 100% sure what the sound is. Uh, this, oh, give him the dish. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to pour this. Uh, use the buttons to match the color and height to pour. Huh? Uh, I guess we want um, blue, blue, and... Okay, wow. Hope people don't order a lot of those. <laughs> well, we didn't run out of wasabi, which surprised me. Oh, this night was shorter because we did night fishing so yeah we are not going to make money, money much money at all tonight oh gosh it's way worse than i thought it was going to be holy mackerel that's terrible that's terrible we should just close the boncho sushi we're not making any money just shut it shut the whole thing down well another rainy day here comes good old dr bacon hello Ooh, it's not easy crafting a suit in one day yeah, you know what else isn't easy? Fighting a great white shark. But I am me, so I did it. Oh, that looks nice. <laughs> Why don't you go ahead and try it on? Oh, I thought I was hoping we'd get a montage. Oh ho, that suits you well. 
Haha, <laughs> the size is perfect as well. Thank you, Dr. Bacon. It feels warm. Maybe because it's made from the divine tree fruit cloth. You think? With that suit, you can not only roam underwater, but also cold places freely. Good. Time to go down to the glacial area. Okay, I guess it's time to go down to the glacial area. I mean, Dave said so. Explore the glacial area. New content, cold resistant diving suit. You got a cold resistant suit that protects you, protects you from the cold environment of the glacial area. Upgrade it further using iDiver to dive even deeper. Ah, oh, crap. Am I going to be able to deep dive deep enough? Udo says the fish we spotted with our radar this week is the humphead parrotfish, the same as last week. Uh, the analysis suggests that the thick head is almost impervious to any attacks. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Too many notifications. Oh my gosh, I got to turn off notifications. There's too many notifications. Farming report is available. I mean, do I care? Do I care about the farming report, really? I mean, okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, I mean, we could see here that um, today, Rice Patty's looking not great with the nutrition. The field's looking pretty good, though. Okay, that's great. Uh, let's look at Cooksta. We are addicted to social media. Whoa, that's a nice looking drink. That's not the drink we made, though, but whatever. Cobra says, Haha, sake cocktails go so well with sushi. Okay, that's all there is there. Kind of kind of quiet in social media land. New, no, deliver opal. Okay, yeah, whatever. Uh, let's see, eye diver here. We've got um, our new suit. We could dive to 800 meters if we could upgrade it, but we can't because we had a terrible night. Like Boncho Sushi, our weapon shop, we can upgrade what? What can we upgrade? Let's see here. Uh, well, it's not telling me right off what is available to upgrade. I thought it would, there'd be like a little icon telling us. What can we upgrade, dude? Not enough materials, not enough materials, not enough materials. So it's not that weapon. Is this really what I have to do? Go through and look at each one of these individually? Oh, okay, so we could upgrade our triple axle to a quattro axle one. We could upgrade our triple axle to a poison triple axle. That's an option. Our sniper rifle, we could upgrade the red sniper rifle to. Kind of like the sniper rifle. Our damage would go from 32 to 47? Really? Holy mackerel. I wish we could increase the magazine size on that. Uh, our underwater rifle currently does... Well, that's not right. I'm pretty sure it does more than 15 damage. And we can't upgrade that. We could upgrade our hush darts. Tranquilized creatures will be of high grade. Normal fish tranquilize after six seconds. I mean, I don't think I'm doing that right now. I'm not really using the triple axle. The sniper, I like the sniper rifle. Let's let's upgrade this guy. Uh, creating this derivative weapon will cause the weapon in listed materials to vanish. Depending on the weapon characteristics, the stats of the listed weapon may not be preserved. I don't know. I still don't understand that. So great. So great. Equip the weapon right away. Where are we going? We're going to the glacial passage. Um, I don't know, man. Do I want to equip this thing? I honestly don't know. Hey, uh, Cobra. Got anything you want to say to me? Ha ha ha, what a suit! It feels warm to the touch. Maybe it's because the suit is made of the divine tree fruit cloth? You haven't figured that out yet, Dave? It's just warm, not hot. I can wear this in a hot place like this. It feels like the suit itself is regulating temperature. That's why the sea people can withstand the cold. The water temperature became unstable these days and many sea people got sick. And also the earthquakes. Something is happening for sure. 
Something indeed. Um, I mean, we're... Let's see, what do I want? Well, I could buy this. A doll decoy. A doll that looks like Dave. It distracts enemies and disappears after a while. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. Well, I can't put anything else in my auxiliary slots. Well, I do believe we are going back to the glacial area. And maybe I shouldn't have bought this yet. Shoot. Um, because I was thinking of using this for the vortex fight, but that won't be till nighttime, and that's why I bought this too. That was dumb, Dave. That was dumb. I'm going to blame that on Dave. <laughs> that was a dumb move, Dave. <laughs> shouldn't have done that. And you saw that we need to look for that horned parrot fish again. But we'll do that later. Achu entered the glacial passage for the first time. Uh, I don't think it was the first time. But maybe this, maybe they mean it's the first time we entered it from, you know, from the boat. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, tranquilizer harpoon tip. Yes, please. Well, let's go. Wow, it's really warm. It's completely different from before. I wonder if it's because the suit is made for the divine tree fruit. Uh, well, time to really explore the area. Okay, we've entered the glacial area. Now we need to take a look around the glacial area. And, I mean, we may as well get us some fish down here. Oh, he's asleep. Can I just... Arctic cod. Oh, one of 25 glacial fish. have we over here? Ocean quahog shell. The shell of an ocean quahog which is larger and lives longer than other clams. That doesn't look like it's spelled quahog, but in Family Guy they live in a city called quahog and it's spelled like that, so I'm going to guess that's how you spell it, or pronounce it. Something's hiding over here. Oh, okay, let's see what's in here. Get some uh, miso. Oh. Oh my goodness. I'm been poisoned by a jerkfish. Actually, that was a um, squid, I believe. So, this is exciting. A new piece of music? Huh, how come I'm not um, tranquilizing or, or shocking these guys? Okay, we got some haddock. This, these haddock are tough, man. Yeah, I really like this music. Hmm. I wonder why they're not being tranquilized. Ah. Ah. Now he's sleeping. He's just sleeping. So when I, when they do go to sleep and I pick them up, is there a chance that I'm getting row from them? I don't know. Look at this little guy. Oh my. A uh, polar eel pout. Up here. Ooh, jade marble, a jade marble. It's probably worth a lot of money at the Sea People Village. Okay, I picked up a jade marble cool let's see what's in this box yeah, there's so many boxes in the bottom of the ocean uh, i can't pick that up yeah it was dumb for me to buy this stuff oh well i do dumb things sometimes uh this is a uh shock harpoon i don't know how that's different than the one i've currently got okay he's sweeping now you need to get away from me, jerk. Yeah, go to sleep. No, I'm keeping this harpoon dart. This thing's freaking awesome. I mean, it puts them to sleep, and then you just pick them up, put them in your pocket, but <laughs> we're going to run out of... Uh, 
we're going to run out of um, space. So what's cool is that we can come back here anytime pretty easily from the boat. Not even pretty easily, very easily. What the? Oh, got some spikes here. Well, I sure hope there's oxygen down here because I'm going to need it. I mean, I guess I could go ahead and use this since I've got it. Hmm. What's this? Uh, the mining level of the equipment is lower than that of the mineral. Okay. Whoa, what's this? What, what was that? Hmm, I don't know why I had to do that. Ah, he's a slippery devil. Go to sleep. Whoops, I... Well, he went to sleep anyway. A uh, gelatinous snailfish. That sounds delicious, doesn't it? Uh, turmeric. Okay. Well, I did not really anticipate doing some uh, fish gathering down here, but hey. Oh, what's this? It looks like a mirror that will take me somewhere. I wish it said what it did, because I don't want to, like, leave. I don't want to go back to the boat. I'm worried that'll take me back to the boat. It looks like a mirror, so I'm not going to use it. I don't want to leave yet. Ooh, look at this. What's this? It's, uh, southern bull kelp. Oh, here's some oxygen. Let's go ahead and grab it. Got a narwhal swimming around back there. Did you see that? Okay, we don't have the right mining equipment. Yep, don't have any room for that. Hey, what's up? What's up, narwhal? Whoa, a huge jellyfish. What was its name? Lion Mane or something? Anyway, it's a giant jellyfish in the glacial area. It must make a nice photo. Let's take a pic. Okay, if we must. Success! Oh, that didn't count as capturing with a narwhal? Oh man, do I try to retake it with the narwhal or not? Let's try it. Let's try to take it with the re with the narwhal. Let's do it. Come on now, we can do this. Are you coming back, narwhal? There we go. Let's do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Nice! That was a good shot. Whoa, what's going on? Uh-oh. Please be friendly. Whoa, boy, you scared me. Even in such a cold place, there is still something for such a big creature to eat. The deep sea really is a mysterious place. It is indeed. Okay. That was interesting. Wait, I feel some heat coming up. I can't go down further now. Oh, for crying out loud. I can't go further down? <laughs> well, that was short-lived. This is really neat. Look around the frame of the screen. Looks like some frost is gathering. Yeah, he's asleep. Yoink! What about you guys? No, you don't want to go to sleep? You're not tired? Hmm. Tough little devils. Another polar eel pout. Well, I don't know how much we're going to discover down here. But we're going to need to make some money in order to upgrade this suit. But unfortunately, tonight is another night that we're going to need to do some um, night diving, I believe, because it's storming. And in order to get that vortex, we have to do some 
night diving during a storm. These guys are tough. Go to sleep. There you go. Good. Uh oh. Oh, look at those little tiny guys. At least they're not attacking me. When I saw them, I was worried they were going to attack me. Probably need a net to catch them. Let's see what's in this pot down here. Salt. Okay. Can't go up there. We are very deep. 500 plus meters. Whoop, terrible aim. Uh, have I got these little dudes here? Let's try these. Yeah. Oh, another gelatinous snailfish. What are the, these guys? Kind of hard to see. Ice fish. All right. Uh, before I go up there. Oh crap. Oh crap. Well, can I put him to sleep? Maybe. Let's try. Oh. Ah crap. Doggone it. <laughs> He's asleep. Get him. Yeah. Tell you, man. Oh, no. No. I'm going to use my oxygen bottle. Poor, poor beagle shark? Oh, well, that's going to be big on the menu. Ah, he's going back to his home. It's fine with me. What is this? Curry block? A Japanese curry powder that comes in blocks. Sweeter than Indian curry. Got my eye on you. Yeah. Antarctic or octopus. Ooh, we got a venom sack. Let's upgrade our weapon. Okay, there's another mirror there. Said I'm pretty sure that'll take me back to the boat. Whoops. Here we've got some uh, black coral. Black coral inhabits the deep sea and is called the pine tree of the sea. <laughs> Despite its name, its color is white. <laughs> well, there's some oxygen there, but I don't need it at the moment. So I turn my nose up at that gift. I'm not interested in you, free oxygen. These guys are not my favorite to catch. They take many hits, and for whatever reason, they do not seem to want to go to sleep. This is a very nice looking area. I like the colors, I like the background, and I really like the music. This is music that I could see myself like listening to outside of the game. I kind of like this, this chill electronica. I kind of dig it. Uh, ice harpoon tip, a cold harpoon tip. It has a chance to instantly freeze the target. Now I'm not gonna get, I'm not gonna get rid of this tip I've got now. It's too good. Oh my! Whoa, narwhal! What are you doing? Why are you being such a jerk? Whoops! Missed him. I wonder if I could put him to sleep. Oh, I can't shoot up. Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Remember, there was oxygen down here. I'm going to try to go down and get it. Oh, crap. He's going to follow me, though, isn't he? Nope. Well, I thought I saw oxygen down here. Is it up here? Yeah. Huh. Who would have guessed a narwhal would attack us? In the elf movie, the narwhal was friendly. What's this long, skinny fish? Yeah, go to sleep. Another ice fish. Oh, I'm over encumbered. Great. <laughs> I mean, I mean, what do I expect? <laughs> what do I freaking expect, man? Uh, what to get rid of? Um, sort by weight. There we go. 
Oh gosh, this is some good stuff, man. I don't want to get rid of any of this. Ice fish is kind of heavy, so we'll go ahead and discard it. Okay. Um, I will try to get this narwhal, though, and we'll try to use our drone to get it out of here. If I could put it to sleep. Of course, that, you know what? That's a dangerous game I'm playing there. I have a ton of stuff in my inventory. And I don't want to end up dead. Let's be smart. Let's get out of here. Let's go ahead down to this mirror. And we'll verify that, indeed, the mirror does take us back to the boat. Let's see. Oh, we could go to the sea people or the boat. Let's go to the boat. We're maxed out on um, weight. Let's go back. That is the deepest we've ever dove in. That's not a word. It's exciting we got some more shark, though. Hey, Udo, what's up? Oh, you brought a picture of something. Can I see? Wow, a giant jellyfish. The tentacles look like a lion's mane. Did you hear something growling? Haha, <laughs> just kidding. You can't hear anything underwater. <laughs> Weirdo. I'll put your picture to good use. Use. I'm sure the readers will love it. All right, we got 750 gold and 150 gold for the bonus. There are photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help and keep up the good work. Yay! <laughs> the fish have been doing it. Uh, crops are all grown. Come harvest. Fine. Oh, farmer's work is never done. How much gas we're spending on this old boat. Harvested eggs. Oh my. What is going on here? Look at this. These rice patties. Oh no, these are, these are. Oh, oh my. That was a lot of, um, a lot of weeds. And I mean, I was just here for crying out loud. We've already got carrots growing, but I'm gonna plant more carrots because we need carrots for our vegetable sushi. And we saw cherry tomatoes. He doesn't sell cherry tomatoes. We don't have access to cherry tomatoes at the moment, unless I'm blind and I'm just not seeing it. Carrots, we're gonna get more carrots. Oh, poo. Yeah, it's nice that it's raining. We don't have to worry about watering everything and anything. Hey, you. No, hey, whoa, don't walk away from me. What are you doing? Come here. Uh, let's do a harvest up. We want to increase the yield of our plants. It's expensive. But it's so, oh so worth it. Dude. Okay, there we go. Harvest up. I'm going to stand, since I'm standing here, I'm going to go ahead and fill this up. Not that I need it, but I was standing right there. I mean, come on. Oh. Um... How much did we need to expand our? It was 8,000, wasn't it? Yeah, okay. We're not doing that for a while. No, sir. Boat. I don't know, do we need to look at our fish? <laughs> I don't like this part of the game. <laughs> Oops, no, I didn't want to talk to you, my bad. 87%. Uh, let's play this game. Maximize. Send to the kitchen. Okay, and then everything else. We'll just leave B. Seventy-five percent full. Let's uh, send some of this over to the kitchen. Make sure you keep two. Gotta keep two here. To keep the fish. Creating more fish. Great barracuda. I'll I'll leave the great barracuda as is. I want more barracuda for. Enhancements. Uh, and here we'll leave all these guys alone. Not a lot going on in there.
new stuff. Um, I mean, there's this. We're gonna leave this as is. We're gonna. You have to think that the more, the merrier, right? We'll go ahead and like really fire that place off and start. Uh, we only have one of each of these. Turn it. Okay. Back to the boat. Well, now we need to make more money, basically, is what we need to do, right? Um, because we need to upgrade our suit so that we could go deeper, I guess. I guess that's what we need to do. Didn't say that was the problem. We could try to go down and catch this stupid horned parrotfish. I call it stupid because I tried to catch it before and had zero luck. We could also, um... By the sensor traps, because maybe we'll see some more sharks or tuna down here. Let's go. Antarctic octopus. It has blue blood and lives in the Antarctic Ocean. It can survive in warmer oceans as well. Okay, so I haven't had any luck finding this horned parrot fish at all. Um, I think I think um, I think I finally did have luck though, didn't I? Didn't I hear like the sensor beeping, but I couldn't get it at the time because something else was going on. I don't remember what it was now, but I remember it was way over here to the right. So let's swim over to the right. Let's pick this up though. This is free money. Oh, so much money. If I remember correctly, the, the horned parrot fish was at about 30 meters, or maybe I'm thinking of marlin. I may be getting my data mixed up in my head. I believe this is as far to the right as we can go. Some rope down here. Use that to upgrade our weaponry. This could come in handy. Oh, shark down there. So, did I determine that the the steel traps don't work against sharks? I don't recall for sure. I think I wasted them against sharks, didn't I? I'm pretty sure I did. Let's let's try it again. Yeah, they're too fast. Um crap. No, don't. No. 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 Oh. Get away from me. Woohoo. Ooh. Let's see if there's maybe an upgrade in here. Uh, enhanced harpoon tip. Well, I'll take it. It's not going to help me against this shark, but I will take it. We got jerky jerk here. Yoink! Let's clear him out, too. Oopsies. Yeah. Uh, so there's a shark down here. Keeping my eyes open for more. Okay, we got more oxygen right there. Oh, you hear? I hear the noise. Parrotfish is somewhere around here. You hear it? Oh crap, I don't want to shoot him. Darn it. Get... This isn't him, right? He's not horned. He's not he's not horned. There's a shark in the upper right hand corner, I don't know if you saw him. Okay, so. Ah, these fish, they're ganging up, man. I'm gonna guess that he's over here to the left. 
We'll leave this shark alone for now. We need to get this horned parrotfish. We've never done it before. Ah, shoot. Argan flargan, argan flarg. No, he still hit me. Man, this guy took a beating. Let's, let's airlift him out of here. We're getting close. Another scooter. There he is. Fishmon found. Okay. Oh, Dave, that's the one. Please catch it without killing it. <laughs> I don't have any way to catch it. I have no way to catch it. So, um, I'm going to need to... Oh, oh, he's not going to be friendly either. Um, oh, why didn't this... Wait a minute. I tried to upgrade my ammo, but it didn't work. Oh, gosh, there's a shark over there to the left, too. I'm going to swim around and try to find uh, a, either a net in a weapon box or a, a tranquilizer dart or something. Or tranquilizer harpoon. I think I see a shark over here, too. There's a hush dart. Will that work? Let's try it. Let's try it. Oh, man, there's a shark over there. Crap, man. Crap, I can't... Ah, oh, man. Um... Ah, oh, I gotta take care of the shark first. Hopefully that'll remain there. This is getting tricky, man. There's ammo way down here, but I have a shark and that dude to deal with. Oh, wait a minute. I have a steel trap thing. Can I use that? No, 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 Oh, he won't come over here. Don't. We know he'll come this side. <laughs> we caught that fish instead. Oh no, that was that was my last one. <laughs> for crying out loud. Why do things never go right for Dave? Why? I'll take it anyway. Doggone it. Well, now I'm back to having to use the... Um... Oh, that's interesting. It says it's new. I didn't think it was. Okay, I need this ammo, and I need it bad. Okay. Um, I need to take on this shark. No, no, don't you touch me. Oh, crap, you know what? Crap. I need oxygen, and I need it now. There's some. No, get away. What, really, dude? Now you're coming at me? He is not friendly. Oh, you are my flargan. Okay, we got that. Okay, I don't want to... shoot that guy. So, what's my... what's my plan here? I'm looking for other boxes. Let's see what we get out of this. This is a shock harpoon. Do I want this? Can't remember whether this... I don't think this puts them to sleep. I don't think that's what I want. There's a box over here. Maybe has a oxygen in it. Or another scooter. Oxygen. Okay, we'll take that. Could be useful in our upcoming fight. So I need to get rid of this shark first. Then... I could try... For the... Parrotfish thing. With 
the hush dart, which I don't know if it's still there or not. <sighs> These jerks. Okay, so. I need to get rid of these jerks. They're going to be a problem. Okay, I got my gun ready. I don't want him to see me. I want... I want to do the shark first. There's nothing useful down here at all. Okay, here's another weapon box. Let's see what's in it. Could upgrade our weapon or something. Another shock harpoon tip. It's the exact same thing we've currently got. That was disappointing. It was very disappointing. Okay, let's see here. Where's the shark? Okay, there's him. Okay, where's the shark? Oh, did he leave? Great. Now the shark has left. So that means I'm going to go over here and try to get this hush dart if it's still there. I hope it is. But as soon as I pick up the hush dart, you know we're going to see the shark. <laughs> you know it. You know it. There's a scooter. Here we go. Yeah, good. It's one of these sharks. These guys are easier to take care of. That's good. Oh, uh, let's airlift him out of here. Crap, I think I just made a mistake. How am I going to get this parrotfish out of here now that I use that? Man! Um... Let's swap that out. Yeah, I'm not going to... How am I going to get this parrotfish out of here now? <laughs> it's like I could put it in a bag. I don't know, man. At least this is still here. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to get him out of here now. Well, let's see what happens. I really don't know what's going to happen. I have no way to get him out of here, which makes me wonder even more how I'm really supposed to do this. Am I supposed to use the net thing? Well, that's all I got. That last one missed. What's this little thing right here? Oh, I hit him! <laughs> he was sleeping. Well, that was all... Okay, I get more ammo over here. Yeah, this isn't gonna work, man. Well, we've hit him three more times and he's still not sleeping. Need some ammo. Well, I mean, at least we finally found him. And in both cases I've seen him, he's been way off to the right-hand side. I don't know where the um, shipwreck is that they mention. Basically just looking around for maybe a net gun. But I don't even know if the net gun will be enough to capture him. It probably won't, let's face it. So, I think I screwed up. So, I don't know, man. It seems like... Oh, crap. The, um... Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh. There's a thresher shark over there. I, didn't, I am not interested in messing with him. Well, I think this is a failed dive because I'm not going to be able to catch that fish. I'm just not. Not with the tools I've got now. I wish that I would find a box that has a net gun in it so I could try it. Because I... I don't know if I'm going to be able to... to catch him with the net gun. I mean, I think there's a very good chance I won't be able to catch him with a net gun. He's too big.
see what's in here. I'm not gonna help me any, but I'll... No, pff, that dumb thing. Oh, okay. This These Thresher Sharks... Not what you want to deal with. Let's get out of here. Um... Uh, I guess next time I try this, I'll bring down a net gun and see if it works against him. I don't think it will, though. I don't think it will. But, oh well. We survived. I'll take that as a win. Well, it's another stormy night. And you know what that means. It means it's another opportunity to go... Night diving and look for the vortex and try the great white again. We'll do that in the next episode. I will try it again. Uh, what will I do differently? Well, I'll, I'll swim around and see if I can't find some oxygen tanks first. Good luck with that. Jeez. Um, I mean, my charms. I mean, this would al allow me to survive for a certain period after running out of oxygen. But once you run out of oxygen, you're out of oxygen. What are you going to do? Poison resistance. We could dash. Increase dash speed. I mean, these two things might be useful down there against the, um, the Great White. Use left control to dash a short distance. But I also like, I really like having extra gun damage because that's what we need to do. We need to wear him down. I don't know. We'll decide next time. I'm going to end this episode here. As always, thanks for joining me. I'll see you next time.